All right there, I'm Sean, and I'm part of Team Mow the Atlantic. And uh, in December, five and a half months, we're going to be rowing across the Atlantic Ocean in this thing here, which is a fours class boat. So there'll be four people inside this thing, two people rowing uh, and two people resting at any one time. And every two hours, we'll switch places and just keep doing that for one to three months is the duration that it normally takes to get across. If the weather's good, hopefully yeah. 40 days. Well, we wish you the best of luck, but um, you might see some bad weather, but that's part of the... This is it, it's just you know. to be expected, hopefully. Yeah. Apparently, within the first week or so, you get a few choppy waves. Right. It's a bit nervous. Second week, they're a little bit higher, but you're right. a little bit more used to it. And in the third week, 60 foot waves, not a problem. So just say, just say the, the, the date then again. So, so we should be setting off on December the 2nd. December the 2nd, right. We're more the Atlantic. Obviously, right. we have a website where you can obviously track our progress as we go across, which is moretheatlantic.com. Right. And we're raising money for prostate cancer charities, Prostate yeah. Cancer UK yeah. and RoboCap. Well, thank you. I wish you the best of luck with that. And yeah, again, let's have another look at the boat. Okay. My name is Cameron Petrie and I'm a trustee for RoboCap. Right. The rowers are rowing the Atlantic for two charities. They are rowing for a national charity which is Prostate Cancer UK and a local charity which is RoboCap. RoboCap is uh, dedicated to providing robotic assisted uh, surgery equipment uh, which will be based here in Cheltenham. Uh, which will cover uh, an area of Gloucestershire, Herefordshire and South Worcestershire. The uh, equipment is specifically uh, designed to work in uh, very tight areas of the body and it's, it's particularly adaptable for prostate cancer. The current uh, operation for prostate cancer is a very major operation which requires a lot of surgery, um, it's very traumatic, a lot of blood loss and a lot of uh, liability for infection. The robotic surgery, however, uh, is very, very much more advanced than that. And instead of um, opening you up to major surgery, it actually allows you to be in and out of hospital in about a day and a half, with no blood loss and very little chance of infection. Well, I wish you all the best, and, and it must be a tremendous experience, and I hope everything goes well. Thank you very much indeed. But we're very lucky to have four chaps who are willing to do this amazing feat uh, for the benefit of charity. Yeah, that's it's, great. It's a, it's a tribute to the uh, to the British public and, and the, the nature of the British public that they all they all seem to be willing to do amazing things to raise money for charity. Yeah, yeah. Oh well, good luck with that. Thanks very much then. Bye.